of attempted second-degree murder and aggravated criminal damage to property. Connor remains in the St. Mary Parish Jail. Well, some who live in Jenneret are concerned about the condition of the lot right next to their home. Tonight, Josh Minnie gets answers from the city about their plans for that lot. Uh, this lot has been like this for like almost two years now. We come reported to Generate City and they act like they can't do anything about it. The grass and the weeds on this property on Martin Luther King Drive are around six feet tall. Residents say they called the mayor, council, and police to clean up the property, but nothing has been done. They have snakes, rats, bobcats, and everything in there. And when we called, we talked to the mayor. She said she was going to try to talk to him, but we never got a call back. In a written response, the city's fiscal administrator tells KTC that the city will begin a new environmental compliance program to address blighted properties in the city. But for now, residents hope something will be done so they and their children can be safe. I would like to see cut. I'm having my baby soon. I don't want my baby around none of that. No animals. I don't want no animals coming in our house around my baby none of that. In Generate, Josh Many, KTC TV3. It's back to school and back to.